Hi everyone. So I'm in Cairo, an old city of Cairo, and um, in a church right now. And this was <clears throat> this is the oldest church here in Egypt. And this, what you see in front of me, is the the way to uh, to Mary's house, the Virgin Mary's house. Um, she lived here for three months, and uh, in Egypt for a total of three years, and she stayed in 42 different places. And then you will go inside the Virgin Mary original. It's divided to three four on your left side, and when you go inside, it was four pieces. So I am entering the house of Virgin Mary. We have to keep our head super low. So, I entered from here to this room. Um, the lighting is quite bad, but these are the original steps, the floor. This was like a living room kind of a thing. And this in the middle was, I believe, hang on, I don't want to say anything wrong. So we have like two tiny rooms. So the one in the middle, I believe, is uh, Prophet Isa Alaihissalam or Jesus room. And this would be Virgin Mary's, for the water they drank from. And that's it, that was the house. So, I am at the hanging church. Uh, so, these, this is what makes this the hanging church because there's nothing under it. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh. So this church is hanging above a fortress and what you see the wood the piece wood right here that's the original one So basically that's the church Oh my god, they built it above it. Huh, interesting. So the whole idea of building a hanging church was to mark the... So before I continue, I just want to bring this to your attention. All the white spots here. Ivory, original ivory. Gorgeous. But so many elephants died. So to go back to what I was saying earlier, the reason for building a hanging church was to mark freedom that due to the political, this is roughly 1800 years ago, that was, that's when it was built. So to mark the resistance of um, the Roman Empire, basically, that right, we are free to express ourselves, we are free to, um, to be Christians, basically. And that's why they put, the, the concept of the hanging church came from the fact that we are above the ground, so nobody can reach us. So what I'm going to show you are the remains of some saints that came um, during that time. Like, I'm 
by two. Luke is supposed to resemble the bottom of Noah's Ark. Oh, interesting. Hmm.